So I'm walking through the kitchen, and I'm like, huh, it's all clean, looks nice, everything's in its place. Let's mess it up with the video. Okay, so today we are doing a thing called the carnivore club. I get excited because I'm a meat eater. I love meat. If you're a vegetarian, you might as well just stop watching this because you're not gonna wanna see this. So I'm looking at the website, so let me give you some information about the company. Because last time I did the Mantry box, do you remember the Mantry box that had that savage beef jerky? I flipped over it, some of the best beef jerky. It is the best beef jerky I've ever had. Well, uh, the Mantry box was like $75 a month, it was crazy. This box is strictly about meat, cured meats and dried meats and jerky and stuff like that. And it's $50 a month, and 55 if you just want to do a one month try. What else, what else can I say? Oh, they, it's not all like beef jerky. They have other cuts, salamis and uh, dry salami and that kind of stuff. They have one from Italy. They have meats that are South African and they have meats from different companies up in Canada. Now, for those of you who follow me on Periscope, I already gave you a sneak peek into this box and some other products that are coming in the future videos. Uh, if you're not following me on Periscope, follow me on Periscope. You get to see things ahead of everybody else. All right, so let's take a look here. This is the uh, We Love Meat box. So this one right here is the all-natural, gluten-free, turkey jerky, crushed chilies, number 19. And the company looks like, is it all from Field Trip? Yeah, the company is Field Trip. These are, this is a variety of their jerkies. All natural, gluten free, regular beef jerky. Original number three. All natural, gluten free. Isn't beef jerky all gluten free? Maybe not. Beef jerky, honey, spice, number 11. More turkey jerky with cracked pepper, number seven. And I don't know about you, but if you ever priced out buffalo jerky, it's wicked expensive. Not sure I'm a fan of it. I'll let you know. This is the crack, buffalo jerky crack pepper number eight. Okay, so the first one that I'm going to do is uh, turkey jerky right there. And you just tear it down the side. There's a little perforate, kind of a little cutout slit. They're not resealable, which is kind of a bummer. Because now I have to go get a sandwich bag and put them in that. And leave this part in so I know which one's which. Not a big deal. When sampling beef jerky, there's a few things I look for that I like, and you may be different. Some people like the really, really thin, dry stuff that you just gotta soak in your mouth and it's just saturate it just to get it to break down. I'm not that kind of a jerky guy. No turkeys aren't raised with hormones. Very cool. Okay. So it starts off mellow. As you break it down, the cracked black pepper is just exploding right now in my mouth. Mm-hmm. Wow. I could really enjoy this at one of Jack's football games. All right. That's really good. Cracked pepper turkey jerky. Okay, this one is the beef jerky honey spice number 11. And you can see the difference between the turkey jerky I just tried and this. This is a lot darker because it's beef. Here we go. Honey spice. The moment it touched my tongue, I could taste the hint of honey, the sweetness in the meat. Later on, as you chew it, once again, spices come out. Great job. Great job. That's really good. Tastes clean, tastes fresh. It's a good product so far. Let's go to the regular beef jerky now. Oh, this is interesting. Whoops. This looks told, this doesn't look as moist. It looks completely different than the other beef jerky. It is good old fashioned beef jerky. Wow. Once again, when you chew it, the seasonings they're using for even the original has seasonings. It's got a great smoky kind of a mesquite or hickory, it can really make it out. Yeah, smoke flavoring, wow. Crushed chilies, turkey jerky. I expect this to have a little more heat to it. Oh, this one's really tough. 
The flavor's there. Just not a fan of it. All right, here we go. Cracked pepper buffalo jerky. I'm gonna see if this is, oh, and they have a, so the big bags have resealables, I can feel it. Oh, wow, it smells like buffalo. Feels moist, very thin. All right, here we go. It's really good. Oh, wow. I must enjoy it. I just took another bite. That was stupid because I have to talk. All right. This is really tender. Really good flavor. Out of the whole group, it's probably my favorite. I don't know why. Oh, it's so moist and tastes good. Good job, guys. Here comes the cracked white pepper right now. My mouth's all heating up again. In conclusion, these are great products. I'd recommend you guys check them out. This company, Field Trip, that does the jerky. I will go on record saying this. It still doesn't beat that savage beef jerky. I have yet to have better than savage beef jerky. But in this test here, all of them are hits, except for the turkey jerky crushed chilies. I didn't care for that. I want to thank the Carnivore Club for sending us uh, this box. Thank you guys so much. Uh, check them out. Let me know how it goes for you. All right, guys? I'll see you on the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.